Epilogue. Hey, lady. Right. Let's go get a. Let's go see what outfits John has got. Where does he change his outfit? No. Hmm. Maybe we can't. Okay, let's ignore that then. Let's go. Where is... Oh, we've got a mission. It's literally there. Oh, the... they're up due to arrive. Okay. Go meet them then. This is the new ranch hand I told you about. Well, I heard you had some trouble with your welcome, but you kept your nerve and protected my property. No, it was nothing, sir. Mm -hmm. I'm David Geddes. Pleased to meet you. John, Jim, hmm. Milton. Thank you for the opportunity, sir. You and Mr. Dickens. Well, you work hard. You be honest. You'll get your keep. I promise you that. Boy has a family. Oh, lucky man. Then you better work extra hard. Good day, Howdy, sir. gentlemen. Sir. You hear that, John, Jim? Extra hard. Hey, hey, get over here. Mr. Dickens, go find old Jim Milton here something to do. Make sure he works extra hard. Sure, Mr. Dickens. Come on this way. I, I was on my chores anyhow. Say, is that your family getting in the wagon up there? Ah, believe it is. Mind if we go welcome them? Not at all. Hey, is it true what they said about you when you arrived? It, that you ran off those hired guns? Look, can we, uh, not discuss this in front of my wife? Oh, uh, no. Sure. Yeah, of course, mister. I don't want to worry her. Oh, yeah. I hear that. Kind of sad then how it ends for John though. Mrs. Milton! Jim Milton! How fine you seem. This kind man just collected us. Thank you, sir. I think we can be okay here. It's ranching work. This place is kinda. It's fine. But I hear you began your career in ranching by throwing your weight around. Real wise, Jim. What was I supposed to do? The place was getting robbed. So you show everyone who's boss? Real fine. I didn't have much of a choice. I gotta go. Jack, when you're done in here, come on out and lend a hand. Crap, how did she hear already? I was going to milk the cows. Come on, I'll do it. You? I are gonna milk the cows? Sure. <laughs> Why not? Oh, uh, I don't know. I, I thought you was, uh... I'm a ranch hand. A new one, at that. When you got here, them hired guns? I was just getting my wagon back. That's all. Weren't nothing. Oh, it weren't nothing. It's about time someone stood up to them fellers. No. Where are you from, anyway, partner? Around, you know, up north, mostly. Been in these parts before, but that was years ago. Oh, <laughs> it's changed. 
The rich fellas are coming in and buying everything, the ranches. But, well, it ain't as wild as it once were, at least. There is that. Say, if it ain't too personal a question, are you a gunslinger, mister? <laughs> Good lord, no. Nothing like that. Oh. Just a ranch hand, then. Just a ranch hand. Failed at a bunch of things, like most men. <laughs> well, I feel a whole heap better having a ranch hand like you around. That is for sure. <laughs> oh, I smelled those cows. <clears throat> <laughs> All right, then. Anyway, here's the cows. Yeah, we used to have a bunch of women here did most of the milking. Most of them drifted off. Okay. You fine with milking? You know, I ain't really done much of it. Could never, never really get the hang of it. You serious, mister? Sure. It's Jim. Jim Milton. Hey, just sit down, I'll show you how. Approach her calm now. She don't take too kindly to surprises. your boy? Sure. Hey, Lancelot. Well, hey, Lancelot. Hey. We're gonna make a dairy maid of your paw yet. <laughs> this is fun. I never thought I'd see the day. Watch and learn, partner. We all gotta earn our keep. That's enough, Jim. Come on. How about you and the boy uh, help me clean out the stables? Sure. Come on, son. now Lancelot 12 sir ain't that grand it's such a fine name I like it I got I got imaginative parents sir <laughs> I can tell now it ain't pleasant work but it's got to be done mr. Dickens said I know what he said we'll do it won't we boy mm-hmm Okay. Well, you get them stalls cleaned out, and I'll see you later. Bye. Okay. Oh, great. Jack, let's just try and take some pride in this work, hard as it may be. Boy, bring that wheelbarrow over here and keep it close to me. Yes, sir. Let's do this. Bronte's mansion now. Sorry, sir. Nothing. Coming. From gunslinging to shit shoveling. <laughs> Great. You almost got me. Calm it, boy. Done here. You finish things up, I'll go check on her. Okay. Let's be if I go.
Hey. Hey. Where's Jack? Shoveling shit in pursuit of the better life you want. Same as I've been. Won't do him no harm. I know. Guess maybe we can last here. Survive. Do a little better than survive for once. I'm tired of fleeing, John. So, what do you know? Me too. Put some coffee on. Wait, we've got two missions we can do. I need to speak with you. Do that one first. Hey, Milton. Can you give me a hand with this fence? Sure. Know much about fence building? Not really. Can't build a fence, can't milk a cow, ain't used to shoveling shits, but took on a gang of robbers single-handed. Guess we all got our peculiarities, Mr. Dickens. What was you doing before you came here? I told you. Wife got cheated out of inheritance. We was in a legal dispute. It was a bad time. That sounds awful, but I guess I don't believe a word of it. I was raised to take a man at his word, and also to believe this is a free country. So free that I can't tell you what to think. So I guess it don't much matter what you believe. But I will work hard, and I learn fast. Okay. Give me a hand with this fence. There's plenty more to do. Pound it in there. We don't want it coming down. Hey. Okay. Again. Good. Now grab a rail, line it up with a notch, and place it in. Position and play. Now lift up the other side. I gotta line up. See. Now the next rail. That's it. You're doing all right. Fine. That looks okay. Go to the next post and pound that in. Give me that post. I hope you've grasped the basics. I got other matters to attend to, but there's more than a day's work here for you. All right. So long. I'll be counting sections when you're done. Okay. Hold on. Put that fence down and get over here, boy. Come on, son. 
on. Milton, get over here. Coming. Come on, give us a hand. Know much about bulls, Milton? Uh, just the basics. Don't make him mad. Angus Geddes, this is Jim Milton. Mr. Milton? Angus is your boss's son. Nice to meet you. Let's try and move this great hunk of Chuck. Come on! Move! Oh! Oh! Oh, crap. I'll get him. Get a rope on him, Milton, and try and calm him down. No, no. Oh shit. No. No. I got to build that. So bad. Nice and easy now, boy. All better? Okay. <laughs> now come on, you hunk of chuck. Easy. You're lucky you didn't kill anyone. Got him, Mr. Dickens. Oh, good. Oh, they're all really How you lazy. Doing, son? A bit sore, but I'll be okay. Thank you, Mr. Milton. My pleasure. And you, mister? Fine. He just got my head. Good. There he is. See you later, Jim Milton. We'll make a rancher of you yet. I'm headed to work today myself, Jack. Huh? So you stay out of trouble. Where are you working? I told you. Cleaning at the doctor's office. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Get the place to tidy. Okay, Pa. I'll see you later. Cool. Alright guys, I'm going to leave them there for this episode. If you enjoyed it, leave a like, subscribe, and most importantly, have yourselves a nice day, and bye-bye.